Okay, so I thought I would do a indoor seed starting update. The tomato plants are doing really good. Um, they're getting pretty tall. I had to raise the light up some. Maybe I'll go ahead and transplant them into little styrofoam cups before too long. Uh, the Amish paste ones are doing pretty good also. They've all got their true leaves. Now these cucumbers never did come up. I don't know what caused every single one of them to not germinate, but... I mean, you know, I don't, I don't keep it real warm inside the house. We only heat to about 66 or 67 degrees. Um... Not during the winter time, but, you know, in this early spring, late winter time period where sometimes it's 60 degrees outside, sometimes it's 40. So, if we just leave it set at about 66. And, uh, but the tomatoes were, uh, planted at the same time. So, you know, it does say for the cucumbers to be, you know, between 70 to 80 degrees to germinate. But it says the same thing for the tomatoes. And they did fine. So I went ahead and put some more seeds, poked some more seeds down in there. So we'll see how this round goes. And then uh, there's our sweet banana peppers. Or no, I'm sorry, those aren't cucumbers. Those are uh, bell peppers. And uh, sweet peppers. They're doing good. And the onions, they're doing pretty good. And then I went ahead and started six iceberg lettuces, or lettuce eye. <laughs> I don't know what the proper plural is, but anyway, I started six, and then in a couple of weeks, I'll go ahead and start the other six. That way I'll stagger and... Uh, you know, not be overrun with heads of iceberg lettuce all at once. And then I went ahead and started some uh, giant sunflowers. Give them a little bit of a jump on the growing season. But you want to do the, the staggering on stuff that you pretty much just eat fresh out of the garden. You know, all your leaf lettuces and head lettuce and um, pretty much all your greens you wanna you wanna kinda stagger when you plant that way you don't get overrun all at once and end up with spoilage but anyway everything's looking pretty good we'll see how those green peppers do like I said they were in the same growing conditions as the tomatoes and they they all went just fine, so I don't know, they might just be a little more picky. Mm -hmm. 